my friends, and welcome to another episode of Rural Contractors. I'm your host, Paul Osmondson. And today's topic is uniforms. Why do you need uniforms? Why are uniforms important? How many of you guys know somebody, companies that don't have uniforms? And people are showing up with holy jeans, just different shirt. Maybe they're wearing somebody else's construction shirts. And when I was working for my brother's company, that's one thing that he did. He got lots of sweatshirts. He handed them out to everybody. He had them for the team members. He had them for everybody. When I was rebranding, you know, I was going to get sweatshirts and t-shirts and I had hired my first team member and he was so excited that we were going to get these. I couldn't get them fast enough, you know, and he's like, Hey, I want to be a part of picking this out colors and let's get the logo on it. Sat down with my wife and they picked out a few colors that work with our scheme. And we got, got that figured out and got shirts ordered the guys wore them all the time. They wore them all over the place. They wore them on the job, off the job, paid a little extra, and we got good quality. You tend to wear that one way more than you wear your cheaper quality sweatshirts. They just feel better. These guys were wearing these sweatshirts all the time, which gave me free advertisement, you know, and they really felt like they were a part of what we were doing, and they want to wear their shirts all the time, which is awesome. I mean, how many brands do you wear that you don't really support that much? If you don't like a brand, you're probably not wearing that very often, which says a lot about the commitment to your guys of like they enjoy what they do. They enjoy being a part of your team, which is awesome. It also helps you build trust with your customers quickly. How many of you know some construction crews that do not wear uniforms? And I'm not talking a strict uniform button down. I'm just talking a t-shirt with your logo on it, consistent colors, clean. If these things get ratty, throw them away. Use them as regs. You always need regs for when you're caulking windows or whatever. I guess I had a box of them in my shop. I said, hey, you guys need more sweatshirts, t-shirts, sweatshirts, help yourself. Here they are. That's what they're there for. So it helps you build trust with your clients. It also helps you build trust with people that aren't clients yet. You know, when we go into Subway and there's four of us wearing uniforms, everybody knows what we're doing there. You know, we're getting lunch and we're from a job site and they know exactly what you're doing. You're seen in the community around you, which is free advertising. It's a level of quality of like, hey, these guys are consistent. They're all wearing the same thing. They're all neat. They're sharp. If I was going to build a shed, I want them to do it. You know, that is important. A friend of mine was telling me a story about a tow truck company was right off the interstate. If there's an accident, who are the cops going to call? This company was organized. They showed up in uniforms, in safety equipment, ready to roll. You know, how many tow truck companies do you know that don't really wear uniforms, have a half broke down rig, whatever? But just by being uniform and knowing that the quality was there that they were going to get every time, how did they do compared to other people in their area? They blew them out of the water. You know, so just by doing a little bit, adding uniforms, you gain customer trust, you build camaraderie with the team, and they feel like they're a part of it and they're supporting your brand. It's free advertising. It's a win-win for you. Why not 